Let's get back out to News Edge reporter Jacqueline Schultz in Newton County on breaking news where a truck fire is causing some major delays on I-20 tonight. Jacqueline, what more have you learned? Well, we've learned a few minutes ago that five people were hurt and what Georgia State Patrol says was a seven car pile up and the mess is still not cleared yet. As you can see behind me, this is in the westbound lanes where there was a tractor trailer that was completely smashed up and there's some other damage and debris still on the roadway. If you take a look at this video, some incredible video from a Fox 5 viewer of that tractor trailer on fire. What I'm told, uh, this was all in the westbound lanes, but in the eastbound lanes, according to Georgia State Patrol and GDOT, there was anywhere from a seven to a 10 car pileup on the eastbound lanes. Coming back live now, you can just see traffic still on the westbound lanes, only one lane open. This traffic is backed up all the way to Covington. It's very slow and go. As you get towards Covington, it's practically not moving, uh, coming westbound. So you're going to want to make sure to avoid I-20 West as much much as you can for the next several hours. Stay with us for this developing situation on Good Day Atlanta for traffic updates. But for now, reporting live in Newton County, Jacqueline Schultz, Fox 5 News. News Edge at 11, the only local news on until midnight to bring you big breaking stories like that one. And